Oh yeah, hi folks, this is Jimodism and we're in StarMade for a tutorial that is build mood and how to make a torus in build mood. And here you can see an example of a torus that I've randomly made. So with our hood on, we know build mood when we press control or rather when we hold control, we have build mood. Holding control, you see this axis. They are usually up to 20, but here on Star Squadron server we have set it to 20. It's different from different servers. So you basically can make different kinds of structure with this one. So we will make a pad of lights like that. You can make cubes and all sorts of structures and it will select this one. Uh, you have selected if I one, now it's stone like that. Okay, so here we have the symmetry build planes. Say that we are going to build a square shaped building and we will, well, save some time, basically. Now we have 10 by 10. That means that you can see here, if I set the symmetry plane, it will not really be exactly in the middle. Then you need to uncheck on symmetry mode, then set the planes, because now we have an even number. That means that it should be unchecked, and if you have an odd number, it should be, well, odd. So, and set this plane also, um, like that. Now, when we set out the block here, you can see they're growing like this. And we can have this for all three dimensions. And if we place like weapons modules here, you can see both are in this direction. And if we now check mirror cubes, see that they are turned in different directions. So if you want to make like sideways cannons on a large ship, this might be very useful. Also works for computers and everything like that. So basically sideways things. However, wedges and regular like parts, armor parts, they do mirror automatically. Now we have something called lighten. And well you can see what that is. Uh, everything looks like not very beautiful, but sometimes when in very dark places, if we for example um, should be needing to do something here, it's quite dark and it, it can be quite useful with having the light and mood. Say we want to make a large hole in the ground. Um, watch out for symmetry planes, you might destroy more things than you thought you would want to do. Well, right click and you see. No, our hole is completely unset. You can press undo. Redo. Undo. That's the most feature of this mood. You can just undo, redo things. That's super, super important. Anyways, remove mood. You can see. Like that. Now we right click. We can easily remove parts like that. So, just undo that. And be aware when you use build mode like this for taking up materials. Um, your precious minerals will not be minerals when you pick them up. Do not try to mine asteroids in this way. Do not. It's just for building. However, um, if you killed some pirates and it's very safe, you can go out from your ship, get in the pirate ship and then like remove everything with build block like this. That's very fast and you won't destroy things then. That's cool. Okay, so now we should check copy paste mode. So let's make a little structure here that you want. Like this. We're basically we're building a very simple little structure here. But it's very special. Like that. Now we want to copy this. Then we need to pick an area. Then we use these tools to picking the correct area. You know, it's three by three. Oops. Three by three by four. Like this. And then we left click. And then we press paste. And then we can paste this. And we want as long as we have the materials for it. So, like that. And also, we n might want to save this for future. So, then we press save. And then we write something in here as OK. It's saved. Now, 
we can go into load and then we can have yep this one okay paste some more we load some other thing you can see I have made a 12 meter long pillar like this one no we don't have that on us <laughs> but you can see it's basically this pillar then we press paste and here you can see I have even saved bar tables and you can see there is a word block in the corner that is needs to be there otherwise um, it will not you will not be able to select the whole area to copy so that's just how it is check the bar by the way so let's undo some stuff it's very useful now we shall be getting into build helper as I promised we should make a Taurus okay so now is the cool feature restrict build moving to helper areas that means you will only be able to build inside your helper structure okay so check that and select torus or you can make a circle or ellipsoid but we'll make a torus well you probably know some basic math so this shouldn't be too hard and radius select like six I don't know and this is rotation this is what degrees we want it in unfortunately there is no pre-rendering so you just have to kind of guess and see how you want it and here here we have a torus okay I want to make a smaller one so going to build helper again torus and you have to select everything again torus radius 15 and radius will be 3 and now we will do some small rotations so you just can see the example of that so it will calculate very weird ways that's very hard to do if you're not very good at math so make a torus like this just from your head okay left click where you want it now as we have it restricted you can just take this to its max that's right if you play in single player you can set the max yourself or if you play like I on a server you need to just hope that the server has something higher than 10 now you just left click on the on the ground just if you would make a enormous cube but you just click and click and click and it takes some time to calculate all these blocks positions but like this imagine how long this would have taken now you can just clear build helper here we have our torus and of course we only have the ability to paste them on the places where we actually had like space like here down in the ground it's just yeah lava and uh, earth and uh, stone this is as simple as that okay so now I have set out lights and everything fancy on this torus and I really don't want to uh, remove those lights and uh, redo it so then we come to the last feature of build mode I will show here yes namely replace mode so go in here pick remove replace filter so now we should be firstly going to select the slot we will replace it with we will make not this in light but in orange hull and we have want to have the lights left out there <clears throat> to be on the exact locations they are out now so pick remove replace filter replace with active slot now we write in stone and now we have the drop down filter oh rock so drop down filter we have rock select ok so now you can see if we would left click we would just spawn this block and we can't remove it by right clicking again so just press undo if you did that you should press right click 
and then you will remove the selected block. So I just can replace this. If I try to replace the light, it won't work. That means we can just make like this huge area and just replace my torus in orange hull. Oh, and now it. Uh, <laughs> I didn't have so many hulls. So watch out for that. But well, that's what that. Now I have showed you advanced building mood. Hold left control and you have it there. So I hope that you have enjoyed this tutorial. And well, this is Jim Edison thanking you for watching. Please subscribe, that helps me out if you like my content. So I hopefully will be seeing you in the next video. Jimmerism out.